Nah, how the first thing they start off with is this man Omni Man blowing up the group chat just so we could sneak these sorry ass niggas. Now I'm not gonna hold you. The way Omni Man pulled up on this fake ass Justice League was straight devious. Bro really pulled up in this Superman pose trying to fly straight through Immortal's body. But of course, Red Rush was able to spot that shit and skedaddle over in time to save his homie. Nah, how dude literally inches away from death and he didn't even notice it. And look how Omni Man turns around, bro. This nigga straight void of emotion, bro, doesn't say not a single word. Bro came here strictly to throw them hands for real. And at first, Wonder Woman tries to take Omni Man's head off, but bro sidestep that shit with ease. Then Darkwing comes in out of nowhere and hits this man with two impact grenades giving this lame ass awkward nigga just enough time to start squirting omni man with this weak ass water type attack and right before omni man could send this fish nigga to the shadow realm the defensive yeah, mvp of this fade red rush pulls up and comes in clutch to save his homies for a second time and i'm not gonna hold you if they had to hand out an mvp for this fade so far this man red rush would definitely be taking that shit home because bros are you keeping the rest of his team alive until he makes one crucial mistake for some reason this nigga decides to go on the offensive and gets snatched up by this man omni man in the process and put into the headlock of death and bro really got his hands wrapped around his noggin with the tightness and the worst part about it is that in this universe bro perceives everything super slow so this shit felt like an eternity for him bro i mean man really packed this nigga up like a lunchbox <laughs> But of course, after seeing that disrespectful shit they just did to their homeboy, the rest of this Justice League gotta run up on Omni Man to get their get back. Then Bro runs up and restrains him, giving this man immortal just enough time to hit him with the clean ass right cross straight into War Woman's hammer. And I'm not gonna hold you, she probably shouldn't have done that shit. Cause Omni Man weaves her next attack and pumps the shit out of the back of this bitch's head before slamming her ass into the ground, bruh. Before he was able to eviscerate her ass, this man Darkwing pulls up and tries to surprise Omni Man for a second time. But straight away, that shit backfires, and Omni Man grabs this man by the ankle meat and gives him that Loki treatment, bruh. And then tosses his ass straight into this fake ass suit. And storm. Now I'm not gonna hold you. What bro did next was straight disrespectful. Cause bro puts his whole ass fish through this D tier ass hero's head. Then uses her body as a human shield against his fish nigga's attack. And that's when the Guardians decide it's time to call a timeout. And they all come to the same conclusion that if they wanna beat this man Omni Man in a fade, they gotta take a page of the Jujutsu Kaisen and jump the shit of this nigga. So Wonder Woman jumps in first and hits this man straight across the jaw. But then Omni Man starts weaving her attacks and sends her ass flying. And I'm not gonna hold you. If this man Omni Man was Divas before, just imagine this nigga with a hammer. Bro takes that shit and sends his fake ass awkward nigga straight to the gulag. Before he gets trapped again and the rest of these heroes start jumping his ass and i'm not gonna lie for a second i thought things were looking bad for this man omni man bro they had his ass dropping to his knees and everything but right after omni man rips his nasty ass alien off his chest before he hits immortal with a gut punch straight through his stomach then he grabs wonder woman and gives her ass a free spinal adjustment now nah, i'm not gonna hold you i don't think anyone's keeping up with this man omni man bro bro really pulled up on earth's mightiest heroes just to give each one of them a fatality viewer discretion is advised